A historic campground in Wichita, once belonging to the Salvation Army, has a new owner. KSN's Asia Simone Smith is here to show us how the new owners plan to keep that camp's legacy alive. It's new at 10 tonight. Asia? Yeah, Jeff, the Greater Wichita YMCA purchased Camp Hiawatha for over $2 million from the Salvation Army. The Y says they plan to continue Hiawatha's long-standing tradition of hosting youth camps. The Salvation Army did a great job with that camp for decades and decades. Um, a lot of families supported that, the camp that's in great shape. Maintaining its purpose, the Greater Wichita YMCA will continue to use Camp Hiawatha to invest in youth. These camps, once they're gone, they're gone forever, right? And we, we at the Y believe that, you know, kids need opportunities to be around positive mentors in positive activities. The Salvation Army said it was a difficult decision to sell the 89-year-old property. With increasing camping costs, the Salvation Army is using their money to cover other needs. We've operated it in various camping functions since uh, the 1930s, and so uh, being able to sell the property to the YMCA and have that legacy of camping continue at a property that is already set up for it was just a tremendous blessing. The Salvation Army is using the sales money for social services, including food pantries, housing costs, and crisis funds. So the proceeds from the sale of the property will help to strengthen our financial picture and, and make us stronger for the future. The Y is set to host summer camps in the 19 building 42 acre property in 2024. It has capacity to do overnight camps, so we'll do specialty camps, family camps, lots of activities. It can be a year round retreat and conference center. The last day at Camp Hiawatha will be open under the Salvation Army is July 17th. There is a nationwide search for a director to run camp activities with the Y. Here for you, Asia Simone Smith, KSN News 3.